Governor Babajide Somunlu has explained reasons for the continued closure of worship centers, insisting that the increase in figures of confirmed COVID-19 cases in the state is one of the major reasons. The incident commander of the response team in the state stated this while responding to Pastor Charles Mandy, who highlighted the critical role church leaders could play in observing the COVID-19 protocols. Both men expressed these views during the Leadership Roundtable organized by Redeemed Christian Church of God, Region 11, which was broadcast live on PLOS TV Africa on Saturday. Every of our stakeholders that we can pull back, that we can speak to, right, they are the ones that have the opportunity for us to carry along and be able to slow down the spread. That's all we're, 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 we're communicating. That's all we're asking for. Once the slowdown is achieved, you will be able to flatten it very quickly and the rate of infection will be slowed, the rate of positivity will be slowed down, and by extension, the rate of, of, of fatality will also be slowed down. Once all that is happening, right, um, we'll all get back to life. I mean, you said it, it will never, this is the first time anybody in 100 years is witnessing. So something also needs to give. Something needs to give the way we, we worship, something needs to give the way we, re, we, re, we relate to ourselves, something needs to give the way we, you know, so it's just very, very difficult time. And you said it, that is the topic we're dealing with in very, very uncharted waters. So it cannot be business as usual. It cannot be the same thing. If it demands that we carry our belt and sing and tell these people what we need to tell them, we will do that. You know, I understand and appreciate that religious leaders are major influencers. There's no doubt about that. Right. But what we're saying is that let's design different modes of communicating this and to ensure that people understand and appreciate this. And I think the very last question you asked me is, when is this big when? Right. And um, I will listen to all of the various stakeholders and we'll make an announcement in another week or two, I mean, less than two weeks, a week or two, once we see that um, the, 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 the prognosis are better for us and probably before the end of the month or early next one or something, we will be able to um, see that the full protocols of coming to worship together will come back very soon.